Jackie, he was arrested in May after an Amber Alert was issued for a missing 12-year-old girl in Farmersville. He faces child endangerment charges, among others, for that. And police tell us he was out on bail when he was arrested on Friday for arson. State police say on April 21st, a seasonal camp and two house trailers were intentionally burned to the ground on Hike Road in the town of Farmersville. Police asked for the public's help and got a number of calls, including from a watchful neighbor in Linden. He reported a suspicious person near a garage, and that led police to the suspect street. Then the Amber Alert happened in May. Monique was arrested, and police say through that investigation, they learned enough about where he went in the past to link him to the arson. Well, the, the arsons and the residences involved in those arsons do not have any affiliation with the Amber Alert or the people that were involved in that Amber Alert. Two entirely different cases, two entirely different set of charges for each of those cases. So it's almost like we have two separate crimes, two separate cases, but we have the same suspect in both scenarios. For this latest run-in with police, Monit faces felony arson and criminal mischief charges. He was arraigned in the town of Machias Court and will go back before a judge on October 4th. Reporting in studio, Callan Gray, News 4.